Did you see it? I saw the news. I know you saw the news. Oh, Kyrie Irving, you opted in after all. Took that money, didn't you? One year deal, y'all. One year, $36.9 million. Exercises his player option. So what does that mean? To y'all, it means Kyrie's going to be a Brooklyn net. You know what it means to me? I guess he's a peon too, huh? So you got to go to work. You got to show up to work. You actually got to go to work. You got you to go up there and earn that money. You got to show up to work. Because even if you plan on leaving the Brooklyn Nets, because we all know that Kyrie doesn't plan on staying in Brooklyn for the full year. He's offended. He's appalled. He's put back by the fact that the Brooklyn Nets actually said you have to show up to earn your money. We know that offends him. We know that offends him. So you're thinking, hey, guess what? I'm going to get the hell up out of here. Philly somewhere, they willing to give me a three-year guaranteed deal. The Clippers could get their hands on me. They want me. Maybe I could get to the Los Angeles Clippers. Who knows? Maybe somehow, some way, the Los Angeles Lakers will be able to work out a sign of trade. Guess what, Kyrie? No matter what options you may think you have down the road, it all starts with you having to show up to work first. You show up to work, then you got a future where you're going to make your money. You don't show up to work, you're stuck because even if somebody wants you, they're still going to require that you show up to work, which means those long term commitments that guarantee four years over two hundred million dollars that was waiting for you. Ain't going to work that way. According to Kyrie, anybody in that position pretty much is a peon. Hmm. Funny how karma works, doesn't it? Guess he's a peon too, just like the rest of us. See you in Brooklyn.